Look at her now. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. Look how cocky she is. You know what I'm gonna do? Look, you go over there. You tell her that I was wounded in action. Tell her I was wounded in action. I just got out of the hospital, and I'm a little shy and a little nervous. And I'm sensitive. Lay it on like I'm a war hero. A war hero. Okay. Not too heavy, indirect. Okay. Right. And I'll wait over here, and then I'll come over. Okay. Lay it on, Eddie. Lay it on real well because I want to get there. Understand? Okay. I'm Don't really screw with this to me. Okay. All right. <laughs> wait. 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 What is it? All right. Okay. okay. Wait. 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 Oh. Wait. Well, what is it? Just tell me what you're going to do. I said, no way. Well, leave it up to me. You know I am a girl, so take it easy. What else about the other thing, though? Sensitive. Sensitive. Well, sensitive. Sensitive. Oh, sensitive. oh you're very sensitive. sensitive. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. Right. Right. Wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? What? What, what am I doing? For her, I'm doing all this. I'm going to go over oh, let's just go. introduce me to our handlers. It's kind of short, but then I don't do it. This is Francie Flannery over here, Jimmy Doyle. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> Ellen Evans. Wrong. I'm Francine Evans. This is Ellen Flannery. Remember her? You've been dancing with her for the past hour. <laughs> Come on, honey, let's go. Mm, such an animal. <laughs> <laughs> Where you go? Be I'll careful. Be right back. I'll be right back. Oh, Mind if I uh, sit down now? After all, we've been formally introduced now. We're all friends. Well, I was just going to say, if you and I had danced and had some fun, it might have been a nice time. I just gave the key to my hotel suite to my friend there because I think he found somebody's really hooked on it. Well, that's very generous. Yeah, I thought so. Seems that uh, you give things away easily, huh? Did you have something in mind? For what? Well, what you just said before. You said that I give things away easily, and I said that you have something in mind, meaning more than I would give anything of myself easily to you, which I could do very easily. Because he'll only be there for an hour or two. Got any juicy fruit? Sure, sure. Bye. Nothing happened after four hours. You expect something to happen in the next hour? I'm gonna be there in one hour, man. I won't argue with you. That's it. Bye. I'd like to talk to you for a second, please. Yeah, step right up over here. Does that happen to be a problem? This will only take a minute, Mr. Sure. Where's Ellen? I'm not running into you. Fancy meeting you here. 
Boy, you're a winner every time I run into you. You're always causing me great problems, aren't you? Good to what know. What are you talking about? You just ruined it for me. Did you realize he's calling the manager now? Yes, sir, I have he's Mr. Powers. He's calling the manager because so I'm here under an alias, that's why. And they're upstairs in the room, and we're all going to get arrested. You have to go up there now and warn them, and you have to get my suitcase and get my sacks under the bed because I have an audition now. I have an audition now, right, right If right you now, mess that up, I'm going to get evil with yes, you. Sir. I don't care how bad I'm going to get evil with you because you ruined it. You Mr. Powell? Get up there. I said, do you mind? I'm having a talk with my sister. It's a family crisis. Do you mind? Yes, I do mind. Well, you're going to have to wait a minute. That's all. Sis. Oh, please, sis. Now, Mommy's waiting. Now, when I went home with my legs, Don't she was this. worried for a few days. Don't Mr. Powell, oh, just Mr. a minute. Mr. Powell, I'm please, you've run up sister. quite a bill with us. You've only been here a week. Would you mind telling me where you were before that? Where was I? That's right. Do you mind telling me where you were? Because you know where I was? I was an angel! Angel! I remember now! All right, wait, fine, Mr. Powell. Wait a minute, wait. See you in a I get carried away, son. Listen. Five nights at the Commodore, three nights at the St. Regis, 25 minutes at the Plaza. Right. Enjoyed room service at each, in one case, use of the hotel limousine. Why do you switch talking. hotels oh, so often, minute, Mr. Powell? You don't even know what you're talking about. You don't even know what you're talking about. First of all, how can I even sign these checks? These are your signatures right there. This is my right signature there. hand, but this is my signature hand. It doesn't even work. You see this? You see that? There's no life in that arm. I might have it amputated tomorrow, and you're telling me that I sign these bills? How? Do I sign with my left hand? I'm right-handed. How can I sign with my left hand? Look at that signature. Look at it. Is, isn't this your sister? She ought to know your signature, sir. <laughs> Listen to this. He's telling me I signed this. Is that my signature? Yes. Look at that. Oh, come on. That's your that's sister. She ought to know your signature. Oh, that's not my signature. Yes, it is. It's that's not... your signature. Don't... She's a little crazy. She's wacky, you know, in the wax. Yes. <laughs> Sis, you gotta go. No! 11 West 55th Street.